was Stuart. Um, I started to play drums when I've been six. That's the fundamental beat. Rhythms of African music around the world. The whole purpose of it is to really give children, youth, who never been exposed to music before, a chance to be exposed. The children get to be exposed to the different rhythms and trained for seven weeks. The show is going to be in at the P P Parker Playhouse in Broad and the schools we're using is charter schools there along with the YMCA. 60 kids aged 13 to 16 and these kids is when they're vulnerable to change. They can either be something great in their life or they can end up in prisons. So I am targeting the kids that we can make a difference. I learned from night to be able to discover and I had that already. I knew what I wanted to go for. But one thing that stays very, very, very powerful in my mind is the tenacity to stay with it. To be passionate and committed is what I think is the greatest challenge. If you are committed to what you believe in and you are passionate about it, doors will open because people feel that and they'll give you, and sincere and genuine. I might have been the first Jamaican to get it. So the whole Jamaican media was in the papers, was on TV, took it as being very, very important and very serious because it means that other people will be able to get through that door to be able to help to do their projects that's important to change communities. The musicians influence the children. The children influence the community by playing because little children say, I want to be like my brother. I can do this too. I love it. So you're changing and transforming the entire community. The, the old people that come to the show will be able to relate. The family, you're bringing back family. So you, and then you're making a bigger statement to the arts. Let's keep the arts in our heart. Let's see the importance of the arts. See, we can change things. Thank you.